Well, welcome back to Base Camp WNC. Well, we're down here right now. We just got done sticking in this 5,000 watt system. We got a 5,000 watt burner. We got six 250 amp panels on this wooden structure right here that they are uh, later on here, they're gonna enclose it. And uh, the gentleman's talking about making a place, park his lawnmower and whatnot. So we'll be able to see if I can film this without blinding you with the sunlight. Enclose the bottom sides of it around here. And park his lawnmower and his garden stuff in here. But for this system right here, for everybody, we got uh, the three panels on the right-hand side wired in series, and three on the left-hand side, and then both of them run parallel. And then, of course, so that gives about 100, uh, 100 volts of service going in. We got a disconnect box. And we had a good time on this one. I had a real good one, so we dug over to here and went up the fence and then went under the house to get in there and let me show you inside the box well here it is in the little solar shed we have a solar disconnect right here this is the 60 amp mppt charge controller and what we've got here is a 5000 watt inverter it does 110 115 what I like about the Ames is they have a central block so you can pull all 43 amps out of it and go into a circuit breaker panel. And what they have here is a breaker for a receptacle in the garage, one for the refrigerator freezer, and then one right here for the living room. And then of course down below here is a battery box and they've got four batteries right now set up for a 24 volt system we put ventilation on the top and bottom of the box vent the thing because they are lead acid batteries well like I said here's everything on here a little bit more update this thing right here of course is blinking at a slow blink, which means it's charging. We just hooked it all up and the batteries have got a ways to charge on this thing. But it, the interface on this thing's like most of them. It kind of scrolls through. It's telling you right there, it's got PV. It's going in the battery. It tells you on the PV side what all it's doing. Then it goes on to the battery side, tells you how much is volts is in the battery, how, how much is going in and how many amps. And then it goes over the load on it pretty easy to do like I said they've got full batteries in there that's a 24 volt system and they can go to 16 batteries in that box right there got a little bit more work to do here putting the man shed back together for him but and for everybody's interested it's about a dollar a watt a little bit this one's a little bit less than a dollar a watt so they got this system for less than five thousand dollars is about forty three hundred bucks really um but if you're interested give me a call it text me email me let me know about it and as usual thank you for watching see you later